I left the city, I've been browsing. Treading water that they drowning. I head on the swivel. Yeah. Hey everybody, it's Zach AK Zach's Reviews. We are back again with another video, and guys, I, boy oh boy, did I have something to wake up to. We actually have the official trailer for the book of Boba Fett. I am so excited to get into this official trailer reaction, guys. Like, I cannot believe I woke up to see this trailer out. Literally, I, I, I forget when this, this show is supposed to come out. I think it's supposed to come out. Sometime this November, if I'm correct, or this December, I'm not quite sure. They'll, they'll oh, I, I guess they'll tell. Oh, I guess they'll tell us in the trailer when it's supposed to come out. Either way, I am super excited about this. You know, I, I, I remember hearing about we were getting this at the end of Mandalorian season two, which Mandalorian season two, if I'm correct, like came out last year. If I'm correct, I think it was like in the middle of the pandemic, so it came out back in like 2020. Um. So, I'm excited to see where this is going to, like, where, like, we, we saw him, you know, uh, take the throne. So, I'm excited to see where it's going to take, like, where, like, if it takes place right where it left off. I'm excited to see what's going to happen in the series because when Boba Fett, you know, made his appearance in Mandalorian Season 2 again, I flipped out. I, w I was ecstatic. I flipped out. I, I flipped out when Luke showed up. Um... So I'm just excited to get back into the Mandalorian world, but experience time with Boba Fett because when he made his, his appearance again, that was badass. And I'm just super excited to get back into the world of the Mandalorian and back in the world of Star Wars because, not gonna lie, those other Star Wars movies, you know, pre pretty left a bad taste in my mouth. And so we got in the Mandalorian series, and I was like, oh my god, I, I fell back in love with Star Wars again because I I, ha I lost hope. When the, you know, the other Star Wars movies came out, I lost hope. I was like, you know what? I was like, this is kind of disappointing. But when The Mandalorian came out, it gave me hope again. And I'm just excited to see, you know, it's, you know, back in the hands. I, I think Jon Favreau and all of them are, you know, they're in charge of, you know, the Book of Boba Fett. Same as how they were in charge of, you know, uh, The Mandalorian. So I'm just excited to see where this is going to go. Along with, I'm super excited, the, my most anticipated, you know, Disney Plus, you know, Star Wars, you know, uh, centric thing is the Obi-Wan series. I'm super excited for that. Obi-Wan was my favorite Star Wars character, so I'm super excited to get in with that on what Obi-Wan's been up to ever since he dropped off Luke on Tatooine and he's been looking over him. I'm excited to see what he's been doing all that time um, in the earlier times of, you know, Darth Vader and everything, so I'm just excited to get into that when that trailer comes out. That's my most anticipated, but guys, we're going to get into this official trailer for the book of Boba Fett. Uh, again, you know, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel, put those notifications, like this video. I'd love to have you guys here, part of this family. But without further ado, let's get into this trailer reaction in three, two, one. Let's go right about now. I'm super excited for this, guys. Okay, okay. Interesting. I am not a bounty hunter. Ooh, we got a new paint job. It looks like we got a little new paint job. Still got that dent and stuff, but I'm loving this, guys. I'm loving this. That Western vibe. Let's go. I know that you sit on the throne of your former employer. Ooh, okay, okay. With fear. Job of it. Talking about Job of the Hut, you took I his throne. Rule with respect. All right. You were all once captains under Job of the Hut. I'm here to make a proposal that's mutually beneficial. I love that. He's saying I'm in charge. Every galaxy. When cooperation can make us all rich. prevents us all from killing you and taking what we want. Oh! That idea. You're messing with you're, you're messing with Boba he Fett, bro. Such insolence to Java. He'd have fed you to his menagerie. That's Please. true. Speak freely. December 29th. Okay, okay. December 29th, guys. We got a date. 
it looks great. It, again, he is he is saying, uh, "Hey guys, my throne. Uh, you guys can speak clearly. I'll let you, you know. Let's 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 you know. Let's build this underworld. Let's all make money." He's pretty much giving them what they want. Essentially, he's like, "Well, we can all make money. We can all make this." You know, we can all, you know, do these jobs, you know, make this a peaceful underworld making money situation. It's just I'm on the throne and you guys cannot stop me. I'm on the throne, essentially. So it's like he's giving them what they want, but he's like, I'm on the throne. I want to do this the right way. I'm like Jabba the Hutt. And I'm just super excited to see what's going to be going down in this series. I'm just excited. I, I got the Western vibes. I got the cool you know, cinematography, I got the cool world building, and exploring different galaxies, I'm here for it, guys, I, 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 I knew I was here for it when, you know, when we even knew we were getting a job, uh, you know, when we knew we were getting a Book of Boba Fett series, when we saw him pop up in, in the thing, I was like, I want to see a series with him when he popped up again in The Mandalorian Season 2, and little do we know, at the end of Mandalorian Season 2, we got confirmed we were getting a book of Boba Fett, and I'm excited because that gives us enough time away from Mandalorian to get back into Mandalorian, because I'm excited because I heard we're getting a Mandalorian Season 3, and I'm excited to see that, where that will go, so I'm just super stoked to see this world keep building. I would love to continue it like this. I'm like, you know, messing up, you know, I feel like that's what we should have done. I feel like in a way, they really screwed up on those movies because they didn't have a plan from Force Awakens on. I liked Force Awakens, but they didn't have a plan going forward, and that's how it failed. And I just love how, you know, John Favreau and you know, uh, Dave Maloney um, all have an idea of where they wanted to go of the earlier days of, you know, of Star Wars and stuff after, you know, Luke going forward after the Star Wars movies. So I'm just excited to see where all this will go on stuff that we've been wanting to know. And it's going to be interesting if they canonize those stuff, if they're not already canonized, to see if we're, will this tie into stuff that we already know from, you know, Force Awakens, you know, uh, Last Jedi and Rise of Skywalker. If those are canonized, will we see it leading up to that if they keep going forward in this in the series type stuff going like in the earlier days of star wars so i'm just excited to see what will happen going forward with this because i love this stuff that we've been getting because you can tell that you know john favreau and dave maloney actually care about star wars when they when they do stuff like this we can we see that they care and they really listen to the fans of what they want in their fans themselves and that's what makes star wars work so well is then you have Somebody that is a fan that listens to the fans, this something beautiful like this happens. And I'm just, I'm here for it. I'm excited. I will be there December 29th, probably doing episode by episode reviews for you guys. If you guys want it, let me know down in the comments below if you guys want that. Again, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel, put in the notifications, and like this video. I would love to have you guys here, a part of this family here on this channel. We're almost to 400 subscribers, guys. So again, hit the subscri hit the subscription bell. Uh, you know, uh, you know, hit the subscription button. Hit the notification bell so you guys always get notified when I drop a video for you guys. Um, literally, we are at 395 or 96 right now, almost to 400 subscribers, guys. I cannot believe that, and I know we can get there today. So please, yet again, hit the subscription button hit the notification bell so you guys always get notified I, I want you guys to get notified and i would love to have you guys here a part of this family here on this channel we're all about spreading love positivity and motivation guys that's what we do on this channel and i would just love to have you guys but i cannot wait to hear down in the comments below what are you guys most excited for are you guys most excited for book of boba fett are you guys most excited for the obi-wan series or are you guys most excited to see the mandalorian season three i am most excited to for probably um, surely obi-wan then i would say uh you know uh mandalorian season three and then i would say boba fett i'm really excited to see boba fett but i'm really excited to see where where the mandalorian goes next because they have built that story so well and i'm excited to see where he goes going forward but i'm mostly most excited for is the obi-wan series and i heard that they're making a luke series apparently with his journeys with uh, baby yoda so or grogu so i'm just excited either way on what's going to happen but guys that was the video i hope everybody has a great day a safe day i'll see you guys next time peace